Say, Mr. Prime, why do you wear a mask all the time? Are you ugly under there, or is Steven just too lazy to draw you a face? Like, how are you supposed to drink with that thing on? I suppose the same way you're holding that mug without any fingers. I'm sure everyone who's watching this has taken a foreign language class at some point in their life, and if you haven't yet, it's only a matter of time before you do. I know I've talked about this topic before, but I think we can still agree that foreign language classes are the absolute worst. Taking French in an American high school was probably the most brain-numbing experience I've ever had to slug through. What? <laughs> You're one to talk. You already speak French. All you did was get easy A's, you privileged snail-eating jerk. Mr. Prime, I really don't have time for your bullsh- Wait, James? What are you doing here? Oh, your weird roommate said he'd be too busy to ruin your video this week, so he asked me to fill in for him. Goodness gracious, Mr. Prime. Anyway, as I was saying, high school French is the worst. Oh, dude, I agree. It totally sucks. But still, you're the last person who should be complaining. Okay, fine. So maybe I had an unfair advantage. I can't really complain about the difficulty or the workload. But it sure was annoying to have to stay awake during class. My teacher wanted me to show the good example and help the other students because I was the only one who could get an A. I honestly felt a little bad for those American kids. I mean, she never spoke English in class or even outside of class. I'm starting to feel like I'm repeating myself, but what do you have to complain about? I don't mean to be that guy, but you should check your privilege. Well, you see, James, being as good as I am in French, I was automatically forced into the role of a French tutor, which was ultimately a very unwelcomed experience. I do not mean too much offense, but the people of the United States are not exactly well known for their respect of other cultures and countries. What? That's not true, you Frenchy snob, frog-eating loser! Oh, wow. I stand corrected. I don't know if this was actually the case, but I'm pretty sure my teacher would just round up all the failing students and send them my way. Like, oh wow, you suck at my class? Well, go to this guy. He speaks French. That's the equivalent of a teaching degree in America. Hey, punk, do my homework. I'll admit that I was not the greatest tutor in existence, but I can't help it if Americans twist my language in naughty ways. Hey, Steven. How do you say happiness in French? Oh, that would be bonheur. <laughs> you said boner. <laughs> yeah. Hilarious. Okay, how do you say a seal? <sighs> Come on, Steven, I know you know this one. Ah, uh, fuck. Wow, Steven, I'm trying to learn French here and you just cursed at me. What the heck? What the frick, man? What? No, I'm not saying fuck. I'm saying fuck. Oh, fuck, my bad. So wait, are you trying to tell me if a shark took his girlfriend to the club and wanted to order some seal, he'd say, Becky, you want some fuck? That is not what I'm trying to tell you, but... Wait a second, is that a seal clubbing joke? Maybe. I mean, you can always get some fuck if you go clubbing, right? <laughs> Remember, kids, if anyone catches you saying the F word, just tell them that you're practicing French. So, we would rarely get far during those tutoring sessions, but I still have to admit that even after all that, I was actually looking forward to see their progress in class. Oh, by the way, Steven, I kinda wasn't paying attention during the tutoring, so I just sorta plagiarized the whole assignment off the internet. What? Actually, you know what? I'm not surprised. Selon toutes les lu canus de l'aviation, il n'y a aucun bien de billy de pour voler. I hate you so much. For anyone wondering, that was James's attempt to read the Google translated version of the B movie script. P.S. He didn't do so well. You know what? I'm gonna stand by what I said. Tutoring was terrible, and my classmates were even worse. I look he got my revenge on movie days because there were no subtitles, so I was the only one able to understand them. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, one time in my ninth grade French class, we were watching a movie called My Father's Kingdom, and in the movie, there was just a little boy's penis. And it wasn't, like, being hidden, it wasn't, like, shot at a weird angle, there wasn't something in front of the, the penis to, like, cover it up and censor it. No, it was just, the camera was just fully focused, head-on, straight at his penis. And, and no one was expecting it either. We were all just watching a movie. Oh, this is no big deal. We're a bunch of ninth graders. And then, boom, there's a penis. And everyone started freaking out like, <laughs> are we going to talk about that? What, what's the deal with French people and their genitals? Am I right, everyone? <laughs> we, are, we are not weird. With that said, take the time to learn about other cultures, you know. Keep an open mind and see what other countries have to offer. Uh, the only country that matters is America. Whatever. Overall, I do not miss taking French one bit. 
there was just so much pressure put on me to get straight A's and never make a mistake, because if I did, I'd never hear the end of it. Come on, I'm only human. My tongue can slip regardless of the language I speak. I'm not perfect. Don't worry, Steven. I'll forgive your mistakes. As long as you wear your seatbelt. Aw, oh, that's really sweet of you, James. Yeah, th French people are... all right. They're okay. Four out of eight. <laughs> Wow, hey there. Nice to see you made it till the end of my video. I don't know where Mr. Prime is, but I do want to give a quick thanks to my good friend James for filling in for him. Merci beaucoup, mon ami. Also, I do want to thank you, dear viewer. If you're new here and enjoyed what you saw, please consider subscribing. I've been revamping this whole channel for the past few videos, so let me know what you think about the aesthetics, the presentation, and all that stuff. Alright, that's all you're gonna get from me, so bon appétit! <laughs>